Hello, my name is Ian Quantis. I'm a forester with Warehouser for Pemina Timberlands uh, based out of Edson. So my typical work day uh, could include uh, an office day at the computer or uh, going up to the field for a field day. Um, have a vest, hard hat, gloves, and, uh, and safety glasses. Um, for navigating and taking data points, um, the iPad is, uh, is a good tool for that. What drew me to a career in forestry was working outside, and I still get to do that to this day. The, the office components uh, do creep up there, but uh, a day in the bush with the birds singing is, is uh, better than any day in the office. Some key tools of the job, a compass. Uh, we, we use the iPad a lot, but you always need to have uh, compass skills. And the other one is a clinometer. Um, and this is used to measure the heights of trees. When I was a kid, my uncle came to live with us and plant trees and, uh, and went on to pursue a career in forestry. And uh, so I, I spent a lot of time in, in the forest as a kid and it was always a, a good way to spend a day. Having the opportunity to take a dog to the bush is, uh, is a fantastic role. This girl, she doesn't come to the bush that much anymore, but uh, she spent plenty of time out there with me, finding trees, having fun. Here's an example of the forest as it grows older. It, it becomes a habitat in different ways. So the, the aspen often gets hollow in the middle, rots in the middle. It's a perfect opportunity for the cavity nesters to come and prepare a spot and uh, and that cavity is used for many other creatures as well, fur bearers and other things. One of the components of my job is to assess the forest for health and focus on the, the more mature timber for harvest. In this case, these trees have been hit by a mountain pine beetle and are uh, the stand is coming apart. There's some dead trees, some dying trees. So we're motivated to get this forest um, harvested, get the trees to town and, uh, and replant forest, replant some young trees uh, in order to keep this forest growing. The sustainability of the forest is critical to our role. We're always planting to make sure that the forest continues and we'd never cut more than the forest can produce. As a forester, sustainability is very important to me. And one of the reminders of that is what kind of forest we're going to be leaving for our children. Uh, we, we want to keep things green and alive and growing. And our commitment to doing that is evident all around us. And that forest will continue to be there for, for our kids and multiple generations. There's so many reasons to do what we do in the forest and practicing sustainable forestry. But these two reasons, forests for our futures, that's, that's as good a reason as any right here.